Hello, my name is Lothon, and welcome back to Potion Craft. What was I in the middle of doing? Making things, yes, of course. All I got here, we got two of those things. The white stuff, albedo. And we were making things in the alchemy machines. Being a bit since I've done this. Got distracted, was doing things, don't you know? Oh my. This looks like a right pain to make. Right pain in the butt. Same with this. Ugh. How annoying. Need protection potions. How dare they? What does the customers want? Make you look younger. Rejuvenation? Ah, yes. Um, well, I need to sell that thing anyway, so there you go. Have a good day. Magic item with the power of lightning. All right, power of lightning, I believe. Oh, wow. Well, we're out of being easily able to do those. There you go, madam. Have a good day. Help me hide from bandits. Oh, you're demanding invisibility potion. Uh, I have no shadow candelabra, sir. Not a single one left. That's exceedingly annoying. Okay. Well, without the shadow candelabra, what is the best way to make potions of invisibility? Let's see. So we got a few windy whirly boys that can get us pretty high up there. So, if I use some whirlwinds, they're a good first step. Have a lot of power to them. I don't know if I can use two in a row though. But I can definitely use a wind bloom. So, whirly wind, a wind bloom send that off on its merry way all the way to get brewed up and then uh, I would love to use spell blooms but I just don't have enough to justify it I don't have a lot of a lot of things actually my word potion making is expensive isn't it very difficult business hmm all right then I shall. Am I completely out of. Well, I have a few witch caps left. But I don't have any shadow candelabra left, which is a pain. I need to get myself some. Alright. Well, let's get a feather bloom, I think, in there. I know what this is. Yes, a feather bloom. And then we'll just use some water. A mix instead of diagonals will just go directly to the source. So there we have, there we have cold leaf, yes cold leaf, bit of a dirty cold leaf, and still the phantom skirt is not the right choice. Uh, some water cap perhaps that would work out here. Yeah? Yeah, just one water cap, a little, little ground up. There we go, lovely. And, ooh, now we can implement some phantom skirt. There we go. Get it up and around, not all the way to the top though. Use some of those mushrooms. And then finally, I think a red hook will do. Maybe not a grasping root. I meant a. Oh yes, the blood thorn will definitely work. All right. In case there's any accidents, we'll grind it the full way. And then we just dance it up a little bit. Dance, 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 onto the line. There we go. And let it drift down, drift down, drift down. There we go. Ha ha. And that is a potion you can't see. Wow. Ah, the strongest potion paid me handsomely. Well, I mean, <laughs> we're going to 
haggle you for all you're worth because that extra 400 gold is a lot of money. Yeah, so this will protect you from knives, shields, bows, axes, yeah, anything you want. It's very good for protection. Poisoning rats, we got rat poison. So our specialty, very poisoned, very rat. There you go. Have yourself a wonderful day, madam. I think that's a woman. Looks like a woman. I can't tell. Uh, okay. Strength, foot, and flight. Strength, foot, and flight. What a bizarre potion. Two lightning, two magic. That's a lot easier. Two lightning, two magic. We'll make one of those for the sake of it, because it sounds a little fun. Two lightning, two magic. We'll start with a feather bloom and drift up to here. And then I will use, I think, a cold striker. Not cold striker, those are Scarly's men. Scarly's cold strikers. Scarly shot nose. But that's not what we're concerned with. We're trying to get magic and lightning. Not some obscure fantasy book barely anyone knows about. It's a very good fantasy book. I would recommend reading it, but... <laughs> it's not, so to say, what's on the menu, boys. Okay. We'll use one witch cap. Because they're not repeating. Witch caps are useful to use. And then... A feather bloom. Well, fun as that may be. It's not at all the way we're going. But actually a whirly wind will do us good work if we can use it right okay so we whirly wind our way up to about there dilute stir pump that is two magic dilute okay two magic and two lightning will be ours with the advent. Oh, I actually don't want to waste a water cap on this. Maybe a evergreen fern? Not good enough, eh? It's actually quite terrible for the results we're looking for. Goodness gracious me. What a waste. I could have guessed. I mean, I didn't, but I could have guessed. This will do, though. We do that. And... There we have it. It's done. I mean, almost it's done. We still need the... Wind Bloom. And we need to bring it to about there. And we need to... Dilute it down, stir it up... A line, and boom. Two magic, two lightning. Magical lightning. And that will go in the funny thing there. And that's good. Then we need eyes and magic. All right. I need some shadow candelabra. Well, we'll have to go see if we can purchase those the next day they come around. As for now, they are not available to us. All right then. To bed with us, and may we dream of shadowy blooms in the night sky. Okay. Perhaps I rely a little bit too much on them. No mushroom man this morning, eh? Slowing your goats, slowing your goats, slowing your goats, goats slowing. That's a grease potion. Where's the goat slower? There's the goat slower. All right. There you go. And you need a potion for your hubby. Okay. There you go. My goodness, he is the lucky man. All right. And only the strongest potion. She'll be upset. Only. Only the strongest of potions. We only get one shot. And she doesn't even pay all that much. She's just a grumpy gus. Um, poison someone multiple effects. Uh, I'm not a bad person. 
I just really like money. But it doesn't make me a bad person. See? I'll, I'll even use his desires against him. Yeah. Oh, no, it hit him. Oops. My, that is... Looks like a slushy, a blueberry slushy. Um, yeah, but to, to show what a caring person I truly am. See, we're going to make it healing as well. So even when it poisons someone, it will heal them. Oh dear. And uh, that was not the effect I wanted at all, but and then it also makes them grow? Yeah. See, it's the anathema potion. There we go. Higher grade. Higher grade? This is as high as grade as they come. You get what you get. I get really bad reputation. Um, hi there. I brought you some herbs and flowers. You said you love to sing. Will you sing something for me? Haha, <laughs> I already told you, I only sing when no one's listening. It's not because I can't carry too, it's just I'm signed. Maybe I'll sing for you sometime, someday, when we have updated the content to allow that. Ho ho ho, madam. The spell blooms are music to my ears. So, no songs are needed from you. Water blooms... I always need more water blooms, let's be perfectly honest. And whirly winds are nice. Terror buds. I'll buy a few of those and look at the flame weaves. You've got so many flame weeds. And how many of those branches do I have? Am I out? Not out, but I only have five left, so I'll yoink all of those. Fluff blooms I'm not as inclined to, but ooh, the cold blooms. I have so many fluffer blooms, or whatever they're called. But the water I'll definitely take as I have recipes depending on them. And while the banana ramas are fun, I think not. Okay, let's haggle. Alcohol. I'm out of practice. It took me a little bit to get there. It's a deal, madam. It is a deal. Alright. Get yourself out of here. Ah, potion to make you braver. Pray handsomely. Pray, pay. Praying is something completely different. Maybe I should have bought some fluffer blooms as my rage potions depend on them. Oh well. You live and you learn. And frost protection. There we go. And I need to get an oily gate. Oil, 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 ole. There we go. And sell. And sleepy by potion. There we go, we got a sleep potion. So much bloody money. I didn't even pick my garden today. What happens if I leave a plant and don't pick it? I'm going to leave those flowers there and see what happens. And we'll make one of these things, I think. Uh, let us see if we can't get that flying done. Oh, we can get that done. And we might be able to get, as well, the night I didn't get any shadow bloom, so those eyes, I'll just have to manually brew that. Alright, but I do happen to have a whole bunch of spell blooms now. So one spell bloom rockets us straight ahead towards the vision potion. One spell bloom. One ice fruit. Ice fruits are good for this. Two ice fruits, not so good. Hmm. Oh, well, brew away. I can save the next steps from here. That hook will definitely not work. Good berry. I don't think I have any recipes that use good berry, so I'll just do a little bit of a swoop up with the good berry. And then... Hmm, how, how do I get up in there? 
Let's see, I have a lot of different water, but none of it really makes me climb directly the direction I want to directly go. There we go. There we go. Hoo, 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 hoo. That, that got a little spookums there for a second. And a spell bloom. We'll get it to there. I really need those shadow candelabras, though. That is where the money's at. No need to waste precious when we got a whirly bloom. So we just whirly, whirly, twirly, whirly it up. Line it up. There we go. Perfectly on the line. Almost perfectly on the line. Good enough. And perfect sight vision. Perfect sight vision. Perfect vision potion. And vision potion goes up top. Flighty potion goes down the bottom. Now we just need the strength boots cats over there. One of those into there. And it's all looking grand. Left a flower here. We'll go to sleep. And see what happens in the morning. I wonder if they evolve or something. It's like you, you have to experiment and learn, right? So maybe it'll turn into a, a new flower. Or did it just disappear? I am going to leave my whole garden as is, I think, today. Because I don't really need to pick any of these as my resources are quite good. So we'll leave the whole garden and see what happens. Oh, my fellow wizard, my colleague. Ah, you just have enchanted paper today. Okay, well, I'll buy a thousand, thousand dollars worth. And when I say a thousand dollars, I'm going to buy about 600 gold worth. So, just so you know, I'm, I'm going to rip you off with my excellent haggling skills. All right, good day. All right, healing potion. Bonus effect healing potion. So, oh my, it starts stacking. That gets messy when it goes all the way around. So, if I just brew casual healing, then I continue brewing from here. And let's, just for the sake of argument, let's get some actually good bonus effects. So, some synergistic, although I don't, I doubt they have synergistic programmed in. But we, we bring it back to zero. We crunch this down. That's a healing potion. That. Um, well, let's not destroy it, eh? Easy now. So yes, it's a healing potion. And it gives you some strength. I mean, it's uh, with some bonus effects. Not the more, the better. So we'll just do two healing and strength. All right. So healing potion, 70 gold. Um... So this is as good as it can get. And it's 20 gold more for about 10 gold worth of ingredients more and extra effort. So if this is 70, sorry, it's 30 gold more or 35. So then 70, 35. So it's about a 50% increase in value. So with healing potions and poison, it's not great. But for doing that, it's a 50% value increase. 50, and also makes them. I wish you could take notes somewhere. That'd be nice. Like a little note thing on customers. I, you could take a physical note, but just in the game. I mean, I could make the notes potion. All right. Let's do it. Um... Let's see. What's the ingredient I have a lot of and I don't ever use? Well, a dried saddle I'm not a fan of, but I think I actually use that to extent. Mudshroom I have a ton of. The gold thorn. Okay. One gold thorn. Save recipe. Um, 
new potion. Where? Ah, it showed up up here for whatever reason. Okay, well, we'll call this notes. And we'll give it a little snake biting its own tail. So, custom extra uh, extra effects, fifty percent money back. Right there we go. So, anyways, we're going to reset that potion. Only your strongest. It needs to be a bad smelling potion. Do I have a stink potion saved? And I do not. I believe the stink potion requires oil. Uh, do I even have the stink potion discovered here? Hmm. Rejuvenation, protection, glue, oil. Shrinking, magic protection, explosions, fire. Oh yeah, that's the garden as it was. Um, hmm. <laughs> okay, where was the stink potion here? So that's the mm, fragrant potion. Did I, did I ever discover the stinky potion? That must be it down there. And. Curse potion. Ah. Bottom left, though. Bottom left. It, it stays, I think, the same. Yeah, the oil is relative, so it should. Oh, there's a stink potion right there. Just had to figure out its location. I'm not as familiar with the oil. Alright. Well, we're on the mud, but this is mud and fire. Um. I mean, the stink shroom. Literally should bring to the stink potion. I should have thought that through. Also brings almost perfectly to the poison, don't it? Uh, goblin shroom. Goblin shroom. Goblin shroom. Goblin shroom. Goblin shroom. Like they're actually really good for this. Goblin these nuts. <laughs> Ah, uh, got him. Got him good. Do, do, do. And we just need a little bit of fire, a little bit of spice, a little bit of... Whew, that's hot. Do I no longer have fire bloom? Oh, there they are. It's like, I can't be out of fire blooms. Okay. Now, hopefully there's not going to be a lot of oil disrupting this. It did disrupt it just a tiny bit. Oh, it got too close to the poppin'. Didn't quite pop though. And a little bit of a drag. Okay. Right, let's get in there. You know, this is actually fairly decent. I mean, it does require a lot of goblining. And, I mean, I'm down for good goblining, but not that much. S still, I think I'll save this as the perfect stink potion. A stench potion. Yeah. Stanky. There you go, lady. Now get out of my shop. Potion so I can be stronger while you work. Ah! You need extra strength baking soda. That's why it's a square. It's meant to look like the baking soda. Mushrooms! Mushrooms! Alright. Shadow Bloom? Shadow Bloom? You've only got one? <laughs> it's so expensive! And I'll take it anyways. Oh, the rainbow caps. Uh, I have a lot of lava shelves. I haven't used any grave shrooms yet. The Kraken shrooms, though, and those water shrooms. I'll use. Mushrooms have their uses. And witches caps are great. I like phantom skirts. Okay. I think I'm happy with that. Always need more mushrooms as well. Alright, we'll haggle it out. I can get a thousand gold off. Well, almost a thousand gold. That, that that's a, it's a deal. It is a deal. Mmm. Tasty. All right. Good day. 
Um, future victims to trust. Well, my reputation's good, so, uh... <laughs> It'd work, lady. It would work. Um, uh, some people, they just, they think they know potions better than me. It's really offensive at times, you know. Uh, I need a potion that can dispel evil? Weak potion works best. I'll pay extra. Uh, I've n never made a potion for dispelling evil, good sir. I don't know what those are. But presuming that curse is over here... It's probably over here that I'll find it? Um... Ah, uh, so there's magic protection, so I can only assume it lies somewhere in this area, if it exists at all. That, that's my only guess, is a Dispel Evil Potion. Yeah, I've never, never heard of one of those. Okay. Dispel Evil. Yeah, now I... Not familiar with that kind of potion. Right, so that is one of those. One of those. Oh, you see, it has like little flowers coming out of it, even though it's, I guess, a sort of flower like. Okay. And the oil's gonna mess everything up because it's all slippery. Slip and slide time, slip and slide. Yeah, I do enjoy the oil. It's a. Fun change to just boons be bad. Uh, da, 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 that's going to go like that. So that will actually be good enough for me because it will lower the height it goes up. So we want that. Oops, and that's a miss. There we go. So it brings it down, evens it out. Right to the edge. Brilliant. Okay. And then one frost potion right here. I'll bring this potion neatly to there. And then we can use one. It's kind of a waste of an arcane. One water potion. Yep. We'll use some simple stuff here, I think. Indeed we shall. All right. One water, two water. I need to grab that. Three water? And we can do th third water. Okay. And it's not going to break on me. Okay. Well, there's certainly knowledge, but don't see any s potions here so far of curse breaking. Okay. Use the witch rooms. And. I mean, the adjacent direction could also be in the negative. No, it won't be in the negative inverse. So it has to be the direct opposite. But I don't see anything here as of yet. Take a swoop on the phantom skirt. Okay. Huh. Maybe it's up here. I'll go along higher along the edge as well. Unless it's, like, hiding in here somewhere. Okay, okay. Take another dance on the phantom skirt. Of course. This time we're going pull. Because I don't really like the looks of that edge. I feel like that edge is instant end to, to your potion. Another pull on the phantom skirt. Have to be careful this time. I really just don't want to touch that edge. Okay. Nothing there as of yet. Okay, I'm going to be careful there because this will mid out. Of course, it won't go to the full height, but still. Okay. This should work out, and if not, I can use the water. This should... Take it right about there. Yep, okay, good. Well, we're definitely 
going to get a circumnavigation award. Not to be mistaken with the circumcision award. Always remember, circumcision and circumnavigation are quite different things. Don't get them mixed up. It'll make someone really upset. Okay. So, nothing there. I can only guess it might be up here. Hmm. I, I've never, never seen the thing of which is spoken or sought as a potion to protect from evil, unless it's magic protection, because that's hexes, so that can dispel evil spells. Weak works, but it potion made from three types of ingredients, no more. Uh, ah, ha ha! Here's this type. Well, that's embarrassing. A weaker potion would suit him better, but... It'll do. Okay. Campfire going? You don't want fire protection now, do you? Sorry, I'm... I, was, I saw this spell, and it's like, Hex, wait, this is the opposite point, isn't it? It must be around here. But we shall take this opportunity, then, to explore. As whenever you mess up, you need to get what you can out of it. Figure out the locations of things. Put it all together in your mind. Learn and expand from all things. Okay. And now if the terror buds. Those are interesting. Um hmm. Fire. I want to use some lush rooms here. Okay. And interesting. That must be a potion I know quite well. I mean, I don't know what it is, but it must be one that I know, you know? Okay, that's probably a haste potion. Probably. Might not be. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Okay, well, let's, let's figure out what happens if we hit the non bony edge, but still the edge of. However, this weird Brussels sprout wall is. We just we just skim it. Uh, I potentially skim it. We'll find out if we will. I actually know most of the potions in this area, so yes, for science. Let's see how quickly it kills my potion. Oh wait, do I just get pushed back? Oh, I do. That's an interesting edge. Okay. Well, see? You learn stuff through experimentation. Can we pierce the nether barrier? That's the next question. Aha! So there actually might be hidden potions beyond the walls of reality that we do not know about. That would be cool. All right. Uh, sorry for taking so long. Campfire, yes. Um, there you go. Specialty of the place. Have yourself a wonderful evening. Uh, blowing up a roadblock. Um, people weak roadblock. Yeah, sorry. There we go. Okay. Oh, why is my game slowed down all of a sudden? It's going like way. Sl it's going slow mo. Did I did I accidentally break it? Hope not. Strength, paw, and flighty feet. Strength, paw, and flighty feet. That's that's a tall order. Okay. Strength, paw, and flighty feet. Well, this potion is perfect for getting the strength when combined in tandem with this stirring pot. So. We'll just give it a few pump a dumps. Boop, 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 boop. Teleport down. One strength. And now I need to get to paw. So strength. 
all the way over to the water bloom land. Water. Water, water, water. Water, way to go. Water bloom. To there. And then. Uh, another one of those. Paw. Okay. Yeah, let's use. I was hoping a red hook might get me to the point I want to go. We'll use a f feather fanny. To get one of those. And then is it flight or flighty feet? Flighty feet. Okay. Flighty, flighty feet. Right. Flighty feet potion. It's a potion of the foot. Scoop to the side. It's going to make it. It's not going to be pretty though. Ho ha ha he he. Too close. Yeah, feather bloomy boom. And one more for the road. Boom. Strength paw flighty feet. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Full garden. Now customers go to sleep. And let's see what happens to the garden. I'm I'm interested. So will it fill up more? Will it not set? Will it reset? Oh, it appears to just fill up more. Interesting. Okay. Although probably more plants would appear because I think areas get used up. I was kind of hoping for like mega plants or combined plants or like some sort of plant breeding. Oh yeah, 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 you need to make your eyes bigger. <laughs> I know what you're all up to. I know exactly where you're going to be dripping that potion, buddy. We all do. You want to make where bigger? Oh yeah, yeah, of course. Okay. <sighs> I do not get paid enough to do this. Uh, so the embiggening is fire. Right? Yep. Oh, it is a long road getting from here to there. It's a long time, but my time is finally here. And I shall see my dreams come alive at last. I will touch the sky. No one's going to hold me back no more. No, they're not going to even try. Because I have strength. Totally sure, going where my heart will take me, I can reach any star, I can do anything. I wonder how far this will take me. Wow. Actually not too bad on the green level, although it's going to get very oily soon with this enlargement potion that is definitely going to the eyes. I mean, he said the eyes, right? Yep, so that, that's what's getting enlarged. Uh, you want me to enlarge what? I'll tell you what it is. It's not what you think it is. All right. You know, filth. Every last one of you. And if it didn't make me money, I'd send you all to jail. Generates. Ugh, you disgust me. Baka. <laughs> I don't even know where I'm going with that. We. I do enjoy using these mushrooms. They're just so happy. It's this little whoop up left to the side. Ah, yes. And now, the alpha male grind set. I don't know why I said that. I just, yeah, I was grinding it up, even though it was more mashing. And there's that whole statement of the whatever 
something something grind set. It just seemed like in the moment the right thing to say, even if it wasn't. Anyway, in beginning potion, saving that. Alright, now be careful because the results might not go as you expected, especially when applying it to certain areas. So you do have to be a little bit careful with that. Ah, poisoning rats. Now that that's potions I can get behind. You know, exterminating vermin. Go right ahead. Putting enlargement potions on your eyes, quotation mark. I guess there's the one-eyed, so it's this eye. Yeah, gross. Uh, ba, ba, ba. Ooh, mushroom man, give me shanto, shanto, shadow. <gasps> take another of them, yes. Ooh, 48 of those, oh yes. Oh, more of those, I'll take more of those, always take more of those. Don't really care about those, don't really care about those. Uh, I'll take like 20. Weird shroom. 21, I guess. I use mushrooms. I have a lot, but I'll get some more. Alright, and we'll haggle it down. I too consumed the alcohol and beer. I particularly enjoyed the wine. Yes. Now then, get out of my shop. What do you want, woman? Clutching your hands. Ah! I see you. You're, you're covering your problems. Yeah, smaller nose. Actually, yeah, I can see you're one of your smaller nose. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, smaller nose. She's not the same one before, so... Uh, I, I can believe this one. Just this once. I can believe it. But only this once. Nobody else, though. No one else gets away with that. Her, she gives a pass. Anyone else tries to claim that in this shop? And oh, it'll be trouble, I tell ya. I'll be trouble indeed. You think you're clever? Oh yes, I'm just trying to make something smaller or bigger, but no, your nose, yeah, okay. You do have a bit of a big nose, so. Big nose, the ocean knows her name. Her honking nose is huge, you can see. Big nose, a pretty big nose, although it's not all that big. Uh, she she just wants to decrease the size of her snoot. You know? And uh, someone with a... My nose isn't actually all that big. Um, uh, someone with a big nose. I say that she has every right to change the size of her nose if she wants to. If my, my nose was big. I mean, it's... I think it's about normal, actually. But people should have the right to change the sizes of their noses. Cosmic... Eh, cosmic works. Cosmic potion surgery for everyone. I'm using the power of the stars to create these potions. So, yes. Cosmic potion surgery for everyone. It's like using the dragon balls to make your butt bigger um and your eyelashes prettier i mean she's doing that for vegeta though does vegeta actually care about that to be perfectly honest i, I don't think vegeta does he might though he might mm. he's actually a good father figure being there for a son's birth and trying to take care of his kids i think vegeta's a better dad than goku yeah, no, Vegeta definitely is. I mean, Goku sort of tries. Like, he likes fighting, he wants to pass his passion along to his kid. But Toriyama has definitely made Goku a far worse person than he was when he was a kid. Because when Goku was a kid, he's actually like a decent person who tried to do the right thing. But now he's just like a fighting obsessed lunatic. Uh, whereas Vegeta has actually developed into a pretty good guy. One snoot decreasing potion. There you go. Don't use all in one place. Help me hide from bandits. Alright. Wait a minute. That's my levitation invisibility. 
do, do I have a need for one of those down here? Um. Nah, wrong, wrong order. Okay, sure, yeah. We'll sell it to you as I have it on hand. Stick a picture on a wall. Yep, okay, sticky potion. Do, 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 do. I do not have a glue potion saved. I got a slow potion. <sighs> glue potion. Where's the sticky at, eh? There's the sticky over here. I remember accidentally making the sticky at one point. I should stop saying making the sticky. <laughs> It sounds inappropriate. Okay, it's down there, so we want to use oil. Why on earth are we using oil to get glue? That's not right at all. Oil to make glue. That's just weird. Cat's paws, levitation, invisibility. Okay. Cat spawn, levitation, invisibility. These are great for getting the cat spawn. Two cat spawn. Just like this. Two about there. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. Feels like a bit of a waste. Yeah, that'll do. Alright. A little bit around here, swoosh back, a nibble up here, a little flick and a twist over here. Not quite tier two now, is it? We're going to use this now. Stir up. Water in. There we go. Okay. Two of those. Then is it two flight? Not flying shoes. It's just it's straight up flight. Oh my. Okay. How do I want to do this? Okay. Well, we'll just take this trajectory. Use the lost potions. Keep that momentum up there. Crimson Grasp into one of those. Okay, straight into another Crimson Grasp. Right about to there. Okay, and away we go. Up here, around here, over there, up through here. Bish bash bosh, do it in a tosh. Uh, where's my laziness gems? Okay. There are the laziness gems. Want one fire flower. Flame weed. Flame on. Um, flame on. Flame off. Oh, that's a waste. Of oh, that is a super waste. Oh, gross. Um, that's what I get for being lazy. Woo okay. Well, because I was lazy, let's do it proper then, I guess. Oh, I wish I had been lazy. Now I have to retributionize myself for my foolishness. I know the phantom skirt actually could like slip in there just perfectly. <laughs> if we like, I don't want to waste those, but if we use like, this here, the phantom skirt might just skirt it out. Ah, it needs to be a little bit more over. Like one water bloom. Other than the phantom skirt might. It'll work. It'll work, okay. Do, 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 do. Yes, good. Okay, that scared me a moment. And then we need two levels of that. Bugger me. Okay. There's two levels of that. Then one level of invisibility. Yep. For moon salt. What a bothersome recipe. 
Do I have any water gems? I've got arcane gems. Okay. Okay. Right. I can work with arcane gems. Arcane gems I can work with. Arcane gems. I would like to have some water gems, but when you lack water, you use magic. Just don't have it here accidentally, the center of nothingness. And one of those in there. There we go, level one invisibility. Dexterity, levitation, invisibility. And th that. Wait a minute. Did. Oh, bollocks, I messed up. This doesn't work in any of them. Because it's invisibility, levitation, or it's the shoes. Damn. Useless potion. Here, take this. And get out of my shop. Alright. Um. Sorry, I'm, I'm frustrated. Alright, uh, well, we'll leave it there for today. So, thank you very much for stopping on by, and I'll catch you all next time. So, until then, spare we thee well. Kiss. <laughs> oh, no, why. Right, bye.